Hi, my name is Officer Eric Fisher, and I work with East Cocalico Township Police Department, and I'm the School Resource Officer for the Cocalico School District. And today we're going to do a virtual tour of the East Cocalico Township Police Department. And as you may notice, I'm not wearing a mask, but there's not going to be anybody inside, and I'm maintaining six foot of distance between me and the cameraman. Welcome. Come on inside. This is the lobby of the East Cocalco Township Police Department. This is where the public would come if they wanted to meet with an officer at the window or if they want to meet in our general meeting room. This is the general meeting room of the East Cocalco Township Police Department. This room is open for public use. We hold youth aid panel meetings here and other meetings where the public is invited to meet with police officers. We're about to enter the secure part of the East Cocalco Township Police Department, and the first thing you're going to see is the squad room. Follow me in. This is the squad room of the East Cocalco Township Police Department. Here, officers have lunch, do reports, and have workstations. Behind me over here is the clerical section. This is where our clerical staff does all of their work. They're truly the brains behind the operation. This is the interview room. This is where we conduct interviews of suspects. This room is equipped with audio and visual capabilities, as well as a two-way mirror for our detectives to observe any interview that's going on. We're about to enter the holding cell area for the police department. Here we have two temporary holding cells where suspects can be held, either awaiting charges being typed or processing. We're about to enter the laboratory of the East Cocalco Township Police Department. Here's where we do fingerprint processing, fingerprint suspects, photographs, and evidence collection. This is truly a multi-purpose room. Each one of these cabinets has different equipment for each officer to use depending on what the job title demands. Inside the laboratory, one of the things we do is fingerprint suspects. And a fingerprint is simply the tracing of your individual, and everybody's is different, fingerprint. The way we do it here is we use an ink system. So I apply a little bit of ink to the ink pad. We roll it out, and then we would roll a fingerprint in the ink, and then onto the fingerprint card. It's Officer Fisher again, and I'm going to show you what's inside of my cruiser, which is very similar to most police cars. As you can see, we've got some cones here, we've got some flares, we carry a fire extinguisher, I've got a box full of different kinds of tools for various different applications, evidence collection tools, some tape, gloves, bags, things that would help me collect evidence. Up here we have stop sticks. These are useful for a high-speed vehicle pursuit. This will deflate a tire safely, allowing us to stop a pursuit. Behind here, I've got several different kinds of crowbars, shovels, and different tools like that that we use out in the field. As you can tell, there's a lot of tools and equipment that we carry to go out on patrol. You saw the rear of my car. Now, these are some of the patrol bags that I carry with me. This bag right here, is full of supplies and tools. This bag right here is full of medical equipment. And this bag right here is my patrol bag. This is where a lot of my paperwork and other supplemental tools would be housed as well. 
It's Officer Fisher again, and now we're on the inside of my cruiser, what I would call the command seat here, because it's my car. Down here we have the siren box, and this is what turns the siren on and off, depending on what we're doing. It's also how I control the lights on the exterior of my car. This is the radio. This would be the police radio that I use to talk to other police officers or dispatchers. This here is the head unit for my camera system, which is mounted up front here. And this videotapes audio and visually what's going on inside my car. This over here is my computer. And on the screen here, you can see this is our computer aided dispatch system or CAD system. And any call that comes in is shown on the screen here and I can read the comments or type or comment back in on the computer as well.